Hello Forge fans! Today we are excited to show you the first iteration of a brand new feature, the Historical Allies. Open your city gates to welcome your favorite historical figures that will surely add a new layer to your gameplay. Before we proceed, we want to highlight that we are presenting the very first iteration of the feature which introduces the core functionality of Historical Allies into the game. We designed this feature to expand the reward pool and introduce even more flexibility with bonus effects that further improve your city. To ensure those intricate functionalities are well integrated into the game, we chose to work in iterations. This means that with every new iteration we will introduce new aspects of functionality and possibly adjust the feature balancing to make it fit Forge of Empires in the best way possible. And as we monitor the way our players play with historical allies and what they have to say about them, we can adjust more gradually and cohesively. So what are the historical allies? Inspired by real-life historical figures, historical allies are new elements that provide even more bonuses to various aspects of your gameplay, be it your army or something else. Depending on their level and affinity, allies will provide different bonuses. For now, you will mostly see level 1 allies, and most of them will have a military affinity, meaning they will focus on providing army-related boosts. Stay tuned for future iterations, for which we aim to expand the level system to enable you to use it to the fullest. The allies can also be distinguished by rarity, which for the first iteration will be limited to common, Although in the future you are very likely to see more rarities, such as uncommon and rare allies. The higher the rarity, the more powerful is the ally. You can use allies for as long as you like, for they are different to the consumable boosts we already have. We also do not treat them quite like buildings you place in your city to boost your stats. Then how do we make room for them? Well, by literally doing so. From now on, some of the buildings we will be adding to the game will feature a special room to accommodate your wise advisors. Once an ally is placed in a room, they start providing bonuses that stack with your other ones. Just like allies, rooms have rarity and affinity, and you can only place a matching ally in a room. To get started, research the Roof Tile Houses technology in the Iron Age. Note that this technology grants you a starter ally and a starter building, the Timeless Junction. This is the first building in the game to ever feature an ally room. If you have already researched this technology, those items will become available to you with the release of the first iteration. All your allies will reside in the Hall of Legends that you will now see next to the Antiques Dealer. Enter the building to see your very first ally, the Valiant Spartan Soldier. As you play, more allies will appear in the Hall of Legends. This is also where you manage allies, which for now means placing and recalling allies between available rooms in your city. If you don't have any fitting rooms, you will see a corresponding message about it. But remember, you get a starter building that features a historical ally room. To see your Spartan soldier in action, first build the Timeless Junction from your inventory. Then select the ally you want to place, hit the corresponding button and bring the ally to their building. Keep them there for as long as you like and swap them when you're ready. An active ally that resides in a room will show up in the tooltip of the building where you place them and in the Hall of Legends. From there you can recall a placed ally with the corresponding button and return it to your ally selection for later use in a different building. As you get more allies and more rooms in your city, this mechanic will allow you to customize your bonuses by combining different allies in a way that benefits your current strategy. In the future, we will introduce more buildings with ally rooms, like the starting Timeless Junction. Stay tuned for our updates to find out which new reward buildings can fit allies and which new historical advisors will soon knock on your door. And if you play on our beta server, you might already know that our future fellowship event will feature both new allies and new buildings for them to reside in. This event will soon arrive to our live servers as well. The historical allies are prepped and ready to lend their wisdom and military prowess to the prosperity of your city. Are you ready to heed their call? 
Let us know what you think about the very first iteration of Historical Allies in the comments below. And to discuss how this feature may evolve in time, consider joining our official Discord server. See you in the next one!